Happy 2021! Welcome to my YouTube site. Aligns to my Instagram site titled A Day in the Life of Queen P. The concept of my YouTube site is We Move. There you go. Happy New Year, everybody. Welcome to my YouTube site, as I said before. As I said, this YouTube site will be focused on the mind, the body and the soul. And the main concept is we move. We move in the sense that we never stand still. We move in the sense that we are forever evolving. We move in the sense that we never allow obstacles, hurdles to get in our way of achieving what we want to achieve. We better ourselves every day. We have self-investment, self-achievement, self-love. That is a concept of my YouTube site. And even more so, it's about my daily walks, capturing my daily walks, capturing the scenery of my daily walks, and basically giving gratitude to everything that we do have. Because I think in life, we, we tend to look at things that we don't have, but when you look at all the things that you do have, you're content. The things that you don't have will come with time. So again, I say welcome to my YouTube site, Getting out today has been a struggle. It's New Year's Day, all you want to do is align your sofa, especially when it's serious minus degrees outside. However, as I said, we always have to get up, have the motivation to get up and move. And that's what I did. About six to seven weeks ago, I broke my foot, fractured is the correct word. And I was laid up for a good four to five weeks in my flat, which is something that's been unheard of. Especially as I'm somebody who tends to do um, about 15,000 steps a day. So going from 15,000 steps a day to literally zero was a lot for me. It was a lot mentally and also physically because I was eating. <laughs> so obviously after the six weeks of being in a moon boot, as you can see here, and on crutches, which I can tell you that contraption is not something that was made for comfort. I was so ready to come off those um, crutches and I'm so happy that I'm off those crutches. After the six week scan, I was told that yes, I am healing, my foot is healing, but it's not yet healed. So we move. We move because I'm off the crutches and I can walk in this lovely moon boot, which gives the support that I need to continue with my daily exercise. Now the amount of steps I'm doing now is not as much as I was doing before but at least it's something um, and you can see my lovely I have a selection I'm a trainer lover so there you go I've got my pumas which I will show you shortly didn't really capture it there hold on one second because obviously I have to balance on the foot that's not so great my puma trainers I've got so many colors of these and I absolutely love them they're so comfortable and they kind of like, you know when you've got colourful things, well when I've got colourful things, I, I find I want to wear them, I want to use them more. And just putting a bit, a bit of colour in, in one's life is always good. So I've got my Puma trainers, which I will be displaying every time I go for my daily walks. And my funky trainers from Afro Pop socks, which is really nice as well, really colourful. And my Puma leggings, oops, misbalanced my Puma leggings which are very comfortable actually, these are really good leggings. They're thick, but they're not uncomfortably thick. So yes, I'm out later than expected, on the moon boots and on my trainer, doing my walk. I think I've done about, let me have a look, I think I've done about 3,000 steps so far. As I said before, my average is about 15,000 steps. In the summer, I was doing about 25,000 steps, which is amazing. And to be honest, I lost weight just by doing just kind of like eating when you're hungry and moving you can maintain and even reduce your weight it's the best form of exercise and it's free but yes on my youtube site i will take you on my journey i will do daily walks but i'll probably capture them about three times on youtube a week so that you can join me in my daily walks where i'll be going to different locations to capture different sites, to share those different sites, just in case you too want to go out and do 
YouTube walks. Not YouTube walks, YouTube walks. You too do walks as well. Walking is the best form of exercise, I believe. It's good on the knees. Running can be quite heavy on the knees. So walking is really good. Sometimes you're walking and you don't even realise how far you've walked. It's a form of exercise that you're doing and you're losing weight, especially when you do at least over half an hour a day. And you don't realise how much you're doing and how much it's benefiting you. Also, coming, coming out of the house and getting fresh air and it's so good for the mind, the body and the soul. It really, really is. It is that escapism, that time to be silent, to think and capture all the beautiful sights, which I'll show you at the moment. I'm in Crystal Palace Park, where it is actually quite busy here. And I'm thinking it's busy purely because of the fact that London is in tier four at the moment. So all we can do is stay at home and go for a walk. So a lot of people have taken upon the same idea and gone for a walk with their families. Obviously I'm walking by myself because sometimes you do want to do a walk by yourself but yes if you want to do it with your somebody in your bubble then go do so. But yeah I would say it's really really good, really good and really encouraging. But yeah here are the sites. Crystal Palace Stadium which nobody's really using now and that's the National Sports Centre which I will zoom into there you go yeah throughout this YouTube I will just show you some sights that I am taking in whilst clearing my mind and preparing for tomorrow another day